So Pincho and I are in an old growth forest right now. He's kind of scared to come up on this log, but you can see we've got this big root wad here. It's okay, buddy. Daddy's going to go for a walk. This big root wad to a cluster of trees that came down in a recent windstorm. Bunch of western cedars, big western hemlock that I'm walking on right now. And this is a fairly common thing that happens in a healthy, mature forest ecosystem. And it's known as a disturbance event that opens up gaps in the canopy, which allows more light to come through to reach those growing in the shade on the forest floor here so that they have an opportunity to grow and fill that, to get that gap, grow big and strong like these western red cedars here, that sicka spruce, or these huckleberries here that are thriving and loving this new light. Now, while it's really easy to see this as a tragedy of sorts because these bigger trees here are knocked over and dead, change is the only constant in life. And though it is sad for these individual trees, this event is also what allows life to continue growing and thriving in a healthy forest ecosystem. In a similar manner, us humans tend to have a lot of attachments to people or things, and when things don't work out or go the way we had hoped them to, or we lose someone in our lives, a relationship ends or something, we tend to cling to that and be really stuck in the mindset of loss and the sadness that comes with it. And it can be really difficult to zoom out and look at the bigger picture, because where there is hardship or loss, life is going to continue living, and maybe that loss is going to open up a canopy gap to allow light in so that something new can grow, and maybe the thing that grows to fill that space is going to be stronger, more wind firm, and pay, play a bigger role within the, the ecosystem of your life, your world. And that thing may even grow from the fallen remnants of what came before on the nurse log created by that disturbance. You know, it's always hard. It's always difficult dealing with these different events that can rock aspects of our world. And letting go of attachments that we have is an ongoing process. But at the same time, change is the only constant in life. And sometimes things happen that provide opportunity for life to continue growing and thriving. And life is going to do that anyway, because that's what life does on this planet. So while it may be tough, just hang in there knowing that you too are resilient and will keep on finding a way to thrive just like this forest has.